Woke up this morning to some new Bring Me the Horizon. Ronnie Rack, he has blessed us with a new track. So, anyways, how y'all doing today? It's Friday, baby. Let's go. Got me some new Bring Me the Horizon Lost. My reaction to that song, I've never heard a single second of it. So, uh, yeah. Do y'all think I should be uploading Bring Me the Horizon content to the Punk Rock Review channel? Let me know what you think in the comments because I'm debating whether or not I want to do that. Uh, also, if you're into punk rock and punk adjacent music, please go check that channel out and subscribe for me. I would appreciate it. All right, let's get into this song. Do you bring me the horizon? Lost. Come on, Ronnie Racky. What you doing for me today, bro, Chacho? Likely something very uh, cinematic. I have, a, it just felt like Taylor Swift was about to start singing in there. Na, 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 na. But yeah, wait. What's going on right now? This is awesome. He's alive. Let's go. Okay, super CG, right? But this is going on Horror Hangout too, bro. That was awesome. Dude, look, okay, music, what do you feel however you want about it? But this dude is creative and he takes chances, he, or risks, and uh, I'm here for it, bro. Oh, for Yo, is this like a pop punk phase? They're gonna, what is happening? Look, dude, like real punk rockers would hate this stuff, but like, I just like good music. So, okay, what is that? Okay. You know what I just realized? <laughs> I've been saying bring me the horizon. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Uh. Oh, 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 I just realized that I've been saying bring me the horizon and thinking falling in reverse because I don't listen to this music very much. So <laughs> I'm going to leave it in, bro. I'm going to leave it in because that's what makes this fun, bro. <laughs> I cannot believe I did that. I'm like, I even saw Ollie Sykes in the video was thinking like, oh, that's interesting that they brought him in to do the music video. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. <laughs> okay, let's get let's get back to the song. <laughs> I feel so stupid right now. Oh, bro, it is what it is. You gotta be able to laugh at yourself, man. My ego is not my what? Whatever he's saying, I'm agree. I agree, man. I feel you, bro. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. Okay, so they're going full MCR, I guess, huh? Like, how many different phases does this, does this does this band have? Boy, I just stuttered. Went zzz, 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 zzz. so my stutter just likes to pop up at inconvenient times. I edited a lot of it out, so y'all don't hear it often. But how, man, this is crazy. What a very uh, what's the word I'm looking for here? What a uh, I guess eclectic will have to do, but like a, a versatile band these guys are. Didn't they start out as like a deathcore band? Stupid, 
Yo, this song is going to resonate with a lot of people, man. This is going to be a big one, dude. Well, they've already had half a million views, not even one day. Like, this one's going to be big, man. This is going to be a song that kids listen to in 20 years. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Yo, why are you making fun of the the incel watching uh what's this stuff called? Um that stuff. You know what I'm talking about. The anime adult section. Dude, perfect. Oh, is that the guy from the Human Centipede movie? It looks like him. I mean, I may just be tripping and wishing it was him. Uh, so this sounds like MCR and I don't know Glaive like a lot. It's got like the Glaive glitching sound in the background, but it's got on MCR all over the vocals. The scream he had a minute ago was really nice. Um, I'm loving this song. This is like I don't relate to it as much because I'm 41 and I'm good with my life. It's fun. I enjoy my life. But if I just take myself and put myself back in like 1997 where I was, you know, 15 years old and in what, 10th grade, maybe uh, actually my second, you know, go around with ninth grade, probably. Then this song would have absolutely resonated with me. And it was like it has like a, a, a punk chord structure and stuff like that. I don't know. It sounds just enough that I might have latched on to it because I liked Blink-182 and stuff back then. And MCR wasn't around yet, or at least I didn't know about them. Uh I don't think they were around in the 90s, were they? They might have been. But this, I would have liked this, I think. And I wouldn't have told nobody about it. <laughs> Insecurities, let's go. Exactly what they're talking about. Hyper pop punk is the, is my jam. Yo, what? Let's go. Let's go. Worth the embarrassment of not realizing what I was watching at first. I just woke up and just like ah oh, man and jumped on a video without thinking much. But dude, this is rad. This song is awesome. Yo, that breakdown was fire, bro. Electro hyper pop freaking easy core. Let's go. Let's go. Am I this Anybody that's familiar with my channel knows that I like hyper pop a lot. So, 100 Gex, Glaive, those are two that I like a whole lot. 
Bro, you mix that with some pop punk emo stuff, dude. I'm in, bro. I am all, all in. All in. Every little tiny bit. Uh, I would imagine that this is heavily edited at this point. So if it is, you can check out the unedited versions on my Patreon. But that was a lot of fun. So I'm going to give that one like a 9.5 out of 10. And I'm putting it on the PRD playlist on Spotify. So if you want to check that out, there's a link in the description. Uh, it won't be on the punk rock playlist because I don't want that one on there. Like I, I'm sticking to like music I just listen to all the time. It's I don't know how to describe it. It's more punk rock on that one. But the PRD playlist is an all-encompassing playlist that, that hits up everything. Uh, that I like on this channel. So lots of hip hop, lots of emo, lots of uh, pop punk. Dude, that was awesome, man. That was the, the lyrical content was great. The production was amazing. The video was outstanding. So I got a lot to do. So I'm going to get out of here. But dude, hope you guys have a great weekend. If you need to talk to somebody, don't forget you can reach out. My door is always open for you guys, man. Instagram and email in the description. Always, dude. Y'all be safe. Have a great weekend. And I'll see you soon. Peace.